going on IGTV peeps? I am here with one of the lower body loading days I tend to throw in each week. Now obviously, depending on the program, these all look a little bit different. If you want to listen to an in-depth podcast, it's called My Training and Nutrition, I believe 2021 is available, where I go into great links here. I'm typically doing the lower body specific loading twice per week. Now we throw a little bit of stuff in every day, but this is what a normal day would look like in here when I really want to beat myself up a little bit. I always start with mobility, nothing crazy. And most of these patterns you guys are gonna know, we just chop them and serve them a little bit different. Sometimes we go circuit style. This one, for example, is in straight sets. So I do mobility to start. I do five minutes of walking lunges, literally just walking up and back down the turf, getting my stride right, just kind of getting my legs loose. Sometimes forward, sometimes backwards, but I'm just doing walking lunges for five consecutive minutes. For a lot of people, uh, that makes them want to quit right there. Next, I move on to five sets of these plate deficit reverse lunges. Now I do all 10 reps on a single leg before moving to the next leg. And I do these, I would say bodybuilding style. So set one, then I'll wait a minute, set two, three, so on. So I'm typically taking about 60 to 90 seconds in between. And what it looks like is I set up on the plate and I typically load it with uh, anywhere from 45 to like 65 pound dumbbells. These are 50s just for reference. Now I'm gonna do all 10 reps on the right leg before I move on. So I'm stepping back into the pattern, full range of motion, letting the right leg do all of the work and the plate's just buying me a couple of inches so I go slightly deeper than I would if I was just from the floor. Once I do all 10 on the right, I'll move on to all 10 on the left. Take like that 60 to maybe 90 seconds and then repeat the pattern for five straight sets. Typically your ass is done from there. Then I move on to the dumbbell deadlifts, your basic hip hinge variation, anywhere from usually 70s to 100 pound dumbbells. These are 80s for reference. Again, it's not just trying to move max load here. It's slow, focus control, especially on the eccentric, letting my hamstring stretch. There's still days where I throw in a lot of the heavy barbell stuff, but this is safer for most of you guys if you're out there. So I'll grab a load I feel comfortable with. Again, these are 80s. And again, keeping them packed tight to the body, shooting the butt and hips back, full range of motion, nice, slow and controlled for all 10 reps. Again, I'm not trying to speed through it here. I'm actually just trying to let everything stretch and go through four range of motion. Once all 10 are done, take the same 60, 90 seconds, repeat for five straight patterns. With the step ups, I usually kind of go into single dumbbell lately and I like the feel of it. So what I've been doing is all 10 reps on the left leg, then I'll move on to the right, but I'm loading the right side. So I'm just driving through this left heel that this plant leg isn't doing a whole hell of a lot. I'm pushing up through the left. I slow and control focus on the way back down. So this left leg is doing all of the work here. Again, there'll be a little bit of momentum, but you're really trying to slow down the eccentric and let this leg do all the work. I'll do all 10 reps, all 10 reps. Again, four straight sets, 60, 90 seconds in between. From there, I'll do just maybe two sets of lateral lunges, sometimes loaded, sometimes unloaded, just to let everything stretch. So if I step into it, I let it stretch for one, I come back for two, and I'll do 30 total, just to let everything kind of move through space, especially if the hips are tight. Again, take about a minute in between, two sets of 30 and I'm done. And I'll finish with sled pushes and pulls. Usually I'll load this to about body weight, so 215, 10 pounds, depending on how many cookies I eat, or how much I hate myself. Sometimes I go heavier. Uh, the rogue sled here weighs 100 pounds, but the plate is only a buck 50. But just for reference, I usually push it all the way down the length of the turf. Once I get to the other end, I'll posture up here and I'll backpedal and pull it on the way back. And I'll keep that pattern going for 10 straight minutes. It's terrible, it's awful, but it is very efficient and it's one hell of a way to cap off any day that you're doing. But that, my friends, will be a typical lower body loading day for me. Uh, again, sometimes heavier, sometimes lighter, basing it off how I feel, and that would be it. If you guys have any questions, hit me up. If you wanna try it, full workout is there. Have fun.